Hey guys, so another what I eat in a day today. Um, I'm starting out my day with um, some fruit, as usual. Um, I have a lot today. There's my brother. Starting off with some grapes and strawberries. And uh, also, my grandmother grows uh, fresh mint and some other herbs. So, um, I have some mint water. I'm gonna fill that up. I feel like my energy is a little bit low today. Um, I don't know why, I'm just tired. I've had um, work in the morning for the last two days, so my body's not really used to that. <laughs> Subbing ended like I don't even know, June 15th or something like that. It's July, uh, so I'm not used to waking up early. Well, I wake up early every day. But when I say I wake up early, I just mean like earlier than I normally wake up. So like 7, 7.30. Because normally I wake up at room around 8 o'clock, sometimes 7.45. Right now, it's 9.21. Um, I'm just gonna finish this. So, Walter keeps trying to leave my house, and it scares me, so I put up some wood. I think he just spoiled me, because he has been staying in the backyard ever since I started letting him go outside. And I mean, it's a pretty big backyard, so he has like some entertainment. Um, but he honestly has just been trying to leave, and it just scares me because I just don't want him to get hit by a car or something. And like, I don't know what to do because I should just let him go because, you know, I've given him the opportunity to go outside. So now, you know, it's my fault that he wants to go outside. Um, so I don't know what to do. But I guess I'm just going to have to let him go. But, um, yeah, as long as I'm in the backyard, I'm going to try to keep him in the backyard. And he seems to be, like, upset that he's in trouble for doing that. Because he tried to leave. So that was boarded, which he can still get through. He was trying to do that. And then I was saying, no, don't do it. And he stopped. But he was also trying to leave from this side. Which I'll show you. This is my bedroom window. He was trying to leave from right there, but she could totally see through. Or he could jump over the fence, but I really don't think he's figured this out yet. I don't think he's figured out he can jump over the fence. Um, because one time he went up one of these trees in front of me, right here. Um, he went up this one, like right on the right. Um, and then the tree started shaking and he got really scared and he jumped down and ran into the house. All right, so since this is a very true what I eat in a day, I'm having this coffee and, you know, it's happening because it's really great. I'm just finishing it off and I'm not going to buy any more coffee, but um, this was really good. I just wanted to try it and I have it with agave because it's not sweet enough for me. So here's Michael. Hello. I'm videoing on what I eat in a day today. <clears throat> what do you think about it? That's very true. <laughs> I had some fruit before. That, um, yeah, so. Michael's having two veggie dogs. No, yeah, two, right? No, one. Oh, Cause one. You ate Because I ate his, um, his bun. <laughs> some bitch. His hot dog bun I used it the other day. Bye, Michael. Bye, it's time to do the adult thing and go to work. <laughs> Have a good day. Love you, see you later for taco night. Okay, so now I'm gonna work out. Um, I'm going to play my workout playlist, which is about um, mm, roughly like about 12 to 15 minutes long. And I'm gonna bike while I listen to it. And then I will take a break um, might take some breaks in between depending on my muscle strength and how I'm feeling and then I'm going to um, Do another set so I'm gonna do that now
Okay, so you guys know the deal with the pasta by now, right? Um, a little bit of red pepper. Mix it around. I have some fresh basil from the garden in it. Ooh, I just dropped some, of course. It wouldn't be me without dropping some. Um, anyway, fresh basil, spinach, living life. Um, brown rice pasta from Trader Joe's. Um, I'll mix that more later. Nutritional yeast. And this is lunch. Okay, guys, so, um, Continuing my vlogging eating situation, and uh, I wanted to show you a few books I've been getting into. I'm reading them both at the same time. I just started both of them. The Art of Happiness by the Dalai Lama, and the other is, which I don't think I showed this last time, I'm not sure, but this one is called Frequency, The Power of Personal Vibration. So, looking on Etsy, for more vegan shirts, <laughs> obviously. I really like this one. Runs on veggies. And I really want something that's like the same material as this shirt, which I think this one is. Like a soft, if you can tell. It's like a stretchy, like soft cotton, which is like so comfortable. Obsessed. <laughs> Guys, call a doctor. I'm undercarbed. But seriously, someone needs to bring me carbs immediately, please. Um, I'm going to eat more of my pasta because I actually saved some of it because um, I just my stomach was kind of bothering me. So um, I'm going to eat some more of it now because my stomach has calmed down a little bit. All right, so Michael is going to get out from work at 8. So... I'm going to get some stuff for taco night tonight. Um, it's 7.44, so he's going to be out soon. And yeah, I'm going to head to Super Fresh. Why do you have that accent? Why are you speaking to the camera like that, mother? He's so cute. He ran away from me, <laughs> but we got him back. Um, he didn't really run away from me. He was in the backyard, and I hadn't heard his bell in a bit, so I was like, okay, let me go check on him. Go to check on him. He's not there. Go to the front of the house. He's sitting in one of the bushes in the front of the house. I can't. I like. He's too much, so... So yeah, so I had my brother come get him. Anyway, I have my chest strap on because I'm going to head, head into the car now. Um, I don't know if I'm going to get any footage in your store, but it's a possibility. But um, just in case you're wondering, let me get my keys. I'll show you how I leave my house when no one's home. Um, I thought my keys were over here, but they're not, so... That's really interesting information. Well, I left them on the bed. There they are. All right. So, we're going. Close the light. So, I'll just go straight down here. And I leave this door open. Just in case I have to get back in on my own. 
Who is that? Oh, I'm leaving. I'm going to get food for me and Michael. Where are you going that way for? Because nobody's home. Where's Joe? He's gone. That was my dad. Let me get into this muddy mud of a mess. So I forgot the camera in my car, but I just got soft taco shells, hard taco shells, and lettuce. <laughs> Michael's laughing at me. Go ahead, go. Oh no, I didn't get lettuce because we have lettuce. Um, and I got a green pepper. So I'm planning on filling mine with rice, green pepper, lettuce, and I was trying to get an avocado, but there weren't any that were ready. But yeah, so we're gonna have taco night now. see y'all tomorrow okay guys so you saw breakfast you saw lunch and now it's time for you to see the door no I'm kidding <laughs> um, this is the end of the vlog thank you so much for watching please subscribe and like and all that good stuff and I will definitely see you in the next video have a great day wherever you are and I hope to see you soon bye is all I needed to do And in every cloud that shapes the sky We watch till the moon rose to the night